Mistress Pullen of Sarnia is accused of aiding and abetting the Red Templars in the Dales. She sold a quarry to them for a handsome sum. They used the quarry to grow red lyrium by enslaving townspeople. The only extenuating circumstance, Mistress Pullen was procuring supplies to keep the remaining townspeople fed. If you'd like to explain your intentions, speak. My crime was misjudgment. The land sale was meant to bring prosperity in hard times. Yet you kept taking coin from the Red Templars, even after you realized what they'd done to the people. Why not? It bought food for the ones remaining. Isn't that enough? You question whether greed or necessity led me. Tell me which you weigh me for. Mistress Poulin, you will spend all your ill-earned money rebuilding the town of Sarnia. If the townspeople forgive you, your debt to them is paid. Your Worship, I will do my best to repair what I have done. Need or necessity, let me. Tell me which you weigh me for. I can't let you go free, but I can give you an honest living. Mistress Poulin, I sentence you to work as a scribe of the Inquisition. Half your wages will go to the town of Sarnia. A drudge on this cold rock? <sighs> as you command. Let me. Tell me which you weigh me for. The Red Templars are the sworn enemy of Orlais. No one in the royal court can test this. The punishment for treason is death. No, please. Anything but this, I beg you. No! The creed or necessity, let me. Tell me which you weigh me for. You made decisions without knowledge of whom you dealt with. That makes villains of anyone. You're free to leave, but don't appear before us again. No, Your Worship. Never. Thank you. As a noble of the Free Marches, I have right to goods won in battle against forces hostile to a sovereign crown. I hereby invoke our treaty with Orlais and claim your earnings for House Trevelyan. By the Maker, I've never heard of such a treaty. This is preposterous. 